Welcome, everyone. Nice Sunday evening we're having. <laughs> I've got some wonderful news to share today. Then we'll pass out some pies. The city-state of San Juan and our city of Portia have agreed to build a road through the Eufaula Desert between our cities. This will cut travel time by over half. Hello and welcome, my name is Monturis and welcome to another Achievement Speedrun. I could have given any better introduction to this achievement across the river. And that's exactly the one we are going to do across the river. This achievement start with the announcement you guys just saw and after that you'll need to meet the mayor in his office. And this is a storyline achievement, it's quite straightforward to get it. You need to take part in the building of the bridge, so you need to do at least one of every commissions and I always say try to do them all or try to do at least uh, the most work, that way you ensure yourself of some great commissions. But this one is quite a lot of work. And along this uh, way, I'm going to give you some tips and tricks to make it easier. The mistakes I made made it so that it took me quite a bit longer to get this thing done. Normally you can get this achievement in a couple of days if you got everything in stock and I didn't have that pleasure. So. I'll show you what to do, how to get it, and that way it still be profitable and you can do this in the half the time I did it. Now we are going to listen to the whole plan the mayor has and that is quite some stuff because it's kind of like two achievement we got across the river and there's also an achievement called all roads lead to Porsche, so that one's coming straight after this one. But for now, we are doing across the river. Help build the Porsche bridge. So, as I already said, you need to do one uh, commission of every three stages, and yeah, we are going to try that. So, after you've met the mayor, there are a lot of new A commissions on the board, and yeah, you get to pick one doesn't really matter which one you take as long as you do one so take a look good look at what you can do and what you can make the most easiest one on the board is the steel frame so I'm always picking that one you only get to build a few and uh, you should have plenty of carbon steel laying around if you don't start building them up because you're going to need it after that you turn it into Albert and then you can go back for another one do remember you need a lot of resources for this achievement, so keep in mind that you can build the stuff. The 10 hardened clay is the hardest one, you need two tempering liquid for it and also you need the blender. If you don't get the blender, turn in those the research discs at Petra because you are going to need the blender a lot. Because else you won't get the achievements. So we are going to do the hardened clay and if you got the hardened 
clay uh, already made it's no problem I'm going to make it here and as you can see I already got the tempering liquid issue and there are some solution you can do it for you can go into the dungeons to get it you can mine it from uh, the hazardous areas but there's also a trick I'm going to show you later on in this video where you can get it quite easy so at the moment I'm turning in a lot of steel frames and yeah I'm basically doing them all I got no challenge from any so if you have a liquid problem you need any tempering liquid you go and see this guy at this moment you should be able to do level 3 and I even did level 4 for this uh, dungeon and he's quite easy to kill just uh, hit him at he swings after he swings and then turn away at the right moment and then hit him two three times and turn away and that way you can kill him quite easy and you can do three runs maybe two maybe three runs in one day and it could get you around 12 13 tempered liquid so killing him is kind of the hardest thing in this but you shouldn't have any problem if you do uh, get up some extra weapons get up some extra armor and put some skill in the uh, skill tree of the fighting so once you've turned in the first four commissions we are going to the second part of this achievement there are going to be four new a commissions on the board and they are split up in one bridge tower and one steel beam and they need quite a lot of resources so be sure to at least have some steel laying around some uh, hardened clay and also some bronze the bronze is for the bronze pipes you need for the steel beam and once you got the first commission we can start building you got three weeks but we are going to do it in a few days first checking up the handbook and try and fight this team steel beam I've been doing a lot of cutting in this video because I didn't got all the resources ready so one thing you should do make some bronze pipes and depending on how many you want to make uh, they're going to need six bronze pipes for one steel beam also you need a lot of iron wood for these seven iron wooden planks you need and for steel frames and for the tower you also need glass and you need a hardened glass but that comes in the end the first thing you need is normal glass so keep a stock of normal glass in your pockets the first thing i do is put everything in the right order and that's quite a hard thing for me to do because i'm quite messy and I also make stuff I don't need so yeah maybe I need it in the end but not at this right moment so let's start and build if you are having the same problem as me and are not able to get enough tempered liquid and this is going to be the tip for you the civil core has one pretty useful function and that's this board you can quite find any resources you need you only need to pay for it so and it's going to take a few days for them to gather the stuff but you can quite get anything you need to build and construct here what i'm doing is going for the rune diving and in the rune diving you can pick up uh, how many stuff you need you get quite some stuff in one uh, run so I'm going to do three commissions and here I'm testing things around if you give them more days it's going to be cheaper but I was kind of late finding this out 
So I'm going to need it in three days, that's the minimal. And I'm going to need three times everything. So I'm getting quite some lip good tempered. And that's what I need to build everything. So let's start building the steel beam. We are starting with the oak wooden planks. And then the frame, the bronze bars. And then at the end, oh yeah, we need the steel frame in the end. But we need to make them. So let's make some steel frames. Quite annoying that you can't search on words anymore. It was there in the past, but it's not there anymore. That's make me a lot of scrolling stuff. So we got our stuff and now we're going to build the tower. The tower needs the tempered glass. It's going to need a hardened clay. And it also needs uh, the steel plates. So let's build up your steel plates because it's needing 10 steel plates and that's quite a lot. I built this commission three times so that was 30 steel planks and that was quite a lot and I also need a lot of hardened clay. But it's worth the money. You get a lot of money for that and you will see that in the end of the video what I did with my money. So check out the whole video and see what I did with my money that we made. Most of the time you'll be waiting for your steel plates to finish or the hardened clay to be finished in the blender. And that's going to take a lot of time. But once you've got all your resources fixed and like here I need one more hardened clay. It's kind of like a pity, you need to wait and wait and wait and make some more hardened clay. So, when I finally got everything, one tower is done. And then the beautiful thing is turning it in and find out where he is, where he's walking. Because most of the time Albert is somewhere between his house and the position where the bridge is being built so he'll be walk working most of the time at the bridge and at the end of the day he'll be running back so we are getting some more bridge parts a bridge tower and a steel beam those are the quests we can take there isn't much difference or there's no no difference at all between the quests and sometimes you just need to see how high you are on the list because that also brings in a lot of money and some data discs and a luck chest but i didn't get that lucky at my chest at the moment so we are going for one more steel beam and we are going for one more tower as you already noticed, this achievement takes a lot of resource gathering and a lot of crafting of raw materials because the really building part isn't that hard, but you need a lot of stuff, a lot of iron wood planks, a lot of steel cables, you need them later on. You need a lot of tempered glass and hardened clay and also some uh, steel plates so build them up if you want to get every achievement and at the moment i'm getting the commission i sent to the civil corps so we're getting 21 tempering liquid and some other stuff we don't really need but now we can at least make the clay we need and we can also make the hardened glass you don't need much hardened glass but you do need it and I also need a lot of bronze bars because I totally forgot to make the bronze bars. And those bronze bars you are going to need for the bronze pipes. And that's going to take some time to make those if you haven't got any bronze bars. Gathering the bronze, making the bronze bars and after that you're going to need to make the bronze pipe. I guess the best tip yeah, I can give you for this achievement is make sure you got your raw materials set up. I don't mean the iron ore or the uh, uh, resin or the soil, the stuff you need for the hardened clay, but I mean the tempered liquid, the uh, iron bar, the bronze bars and even the steel plates. 
you are going to need those and if you need to craft them first it's going to take a lot of time and you can go with the minimum requirements of this achievement making two uh, commissions of every phase but I would make the money I'm greedy I'm going to make as much as I can I want to beat Higgins in every kind of way <laughs> so we are bringing in another British tower and another steel beam and we are going to get the last commission of the second phase of this achievement and we are going to make another steel beam and another bridge tower if you get the resources all set up then the second tough thing in this game is coming to your attention you need to put everything in your hotbar I wish they would change that they already did it for the working bench so you, if you get it in the boxes inside your house somewhere it will come out of it and at this moment I was looking for something else some steel plates and the last thing we need for the tower is our hardened glass or strengthened glass I keep saying hardened glass but it's hardened clay and strengthened glass and then we got another tower finished only one more thing to do and that is one more steel beam we should have all the resources by now so it should be a quick build or do we we need to search in my chaotic inventory because it's quite quite a chaos in there you can sort it all up and it will still not be in a logical position the search system would be nice Let's speed things up a lot or maybe just click on it if you have it in somewhere in your boxes or in your inventory so the fun part is you can go to the bridge and watch it being built and every commission you turn in one part of the bridge is being built and that we did because we needed to make wait for the iron wood that we didn't have so most of the time I had to wait for resources and if you're done with the second phase then we are going for the third phase this one is the steel beam and the lamps you need to make for the bridge the bright lights bright lights are being built with tin alloy and also a strengthening glass and you make, need to make two of them I found out early in the game Mostly I don't read the commission and look at the pictures and make the stuff so that, that's kind of hard because here I found out I needed another light. And then you can turn it in. I just cut out the part that I was walking to Albert trying to find him and to turn it in. And there we got it. In the second phase you only need to build the tower and the steel beam and those commissions are all the same. The third phase is about making the steel cable and the bright lights. So if you build four bright lights and not the steel cables then when you walk to Albert and you find out there's no question mark you kind of scratch your head what is going on and uh, what I did here because I just found out I took the wrong commission and I needed to make the steel cables luckily I had the resources so it was just a matter of time making the police and I should make four I would advise to make four because Higgins isn't going to be anywhere near that fast as you be and we are making the steel cables pulling them in and then we walk fast to the board the commission board take the right one because I want to do the bright lights because I already made those so I'm exactly here Higgins is already looking at the board and we are going fast back to Albert turn in the bright lights and before Higgins even going to take one commission I took the last one that way I got all the four commissions of the last phase and that is also slowly coming to the end of this achievement run if you enjoyed this achievement run please subscribe to my channel it really helps me build and grow this community and if you got any comment leave it in the comment down below so 
now we are making some other commissions because yeah I need some more money I got my big house and you're going to see it from the inside and just a few seconds because we need to turn in the last cables and you would say I made all the commissions I'm going to turn in so now we should get the achievement if we click on Albert and not on the other guy mint yes we're turning in and hey there's no achievement where is it well you need to sleep over it and you'll get the achievement once you go to bed so I'm going to my new big house that I bought with my money I got and yeah I need to do decorate it maybe I should invite somebody else to do that and there it is the achievement well thank you for watching and I hope you guys all enjoyed this speedrun and see you in the next speedrun